What's going on guys? Mike Schemer here. Um, just a quick video here. A question that I've gotten a couple times and a question that I think I should honestly be getting more often. Um, and that is, should I join Threads, the social media platform uh, by Meta, you know, Facebook, Instagram, um, WhatsApp. So I mean, Threads is their most recent uh, social network and it's also the newest social network pretty much the newest um, relevant social network in a few years really since um, oh, what was that audio on clubhouse that was so hot during the 2020-2021 uh, events and then just collapsed um, so anyways Threads, it's almost like a Google Plus because they grew, Threads grew their whole platform really fast by leveraging existing users, in this case Instagram and some Facebook users, just like Google Plus um, pretty much gave everyone a username who had a Gmail account or a Google reviewer account or, you know, any of the dozens of failing or succeeding Google products. So there were, I think, like 100 million Google Plus members pretty fast or something, something like that, tens of millions. It was a big deal um, in terms of user number, uh, but the usage, the actual usage of the platform was very low, especially after starting. And Threads is kind of like that, uh, not as bad at all, but it is, it is kind of, it, you have some parallels between those two platforms. So Threads, it's really simple sharing images, sharing links. Hold on a sec, guys. <laughs> Guess there's a fire. Anyways, you share very basic stuff on threads and I'll be honest most people just syndicate what they already post on Instagram they post the exact same thing on threads and it's it kind of just ends up being a dumping ground of links and posts I don't know what's going on here I really don't I don't know what's going on here What's going on these days to be honest um <laughs> that was not for me obviously um i don't know if it's some event or some big incident crazy stuff anyways so threads you can really you can succeed on it because there's a lot less um competition because people really do kind of the minimal effort i i'm i am honest you know when i say i'm guilty of that as well uh, just because I'm so busy on other platforms, I'm so busy uh, with two businesses and all this other stuff, um, that Threads kind of, you know, it's it goes to my lower priority stuff like Pinterest, uh, Snapchat, and TikTok. Um, I'm not saying it should be like that. It really depends on what you do and your following. Um, but, you know, I I mostly just put a few links up. I get some followers. I have my account you know it's indexed I have links to it um, you know I follow a few people I like and comment on their posts uh, once in a while and you know kind of I do a little beyond the bare minimum but um, you know I have one account with a business account with um, 650 followers I have a, my personal verified account and it's verified too, it's got the blue check mark because I'm verified on Instagram. So that's a good bonus too if you're verified. Uh, but my personal verified one is around 350, maybe 360, 370 in terms of 
uh, follower count. So I mean, th these are small accounts, but they can still get a little bit of reach. And the more effort I put into them, the better my results would be, obviously. Um, but it's really simple, really simple posts. You can't get too complicated. You can't use too much in like in the ways of like hashtags and and links. You know, it's it's very simplified. Um, so should you use it? Yes, you should. Should you use it for more than five minutes a week or ten minutes a week? Um, that's up to you, but there's no reason not to use it because it's free, because it's easy to use, it's easy to syndicate your content, and jeez, it's bad, uh, bad luck today for this video. Um, good thing it's just about threads and nothing that super important. Um, poor threads, and uh, yeah, so they, they got way over 100 million users very quickly because they leveraged their existing platforms and the engagement and the, use, the usage, the daily active users, monthly active users went way down after the debut because it crushed all other social networks its first few weeks, its first month, and then, you know, a nosedive. Um, so yeah, there's no reason not to use it. You can still get some traffic, you can get some clicks, and um, you know, that's all there is to it. So, <clears throat> thank you guys for watching. I'm just gonna be done. <laughs> I'm gonna be done with this crazy video. Um, you know, just isn't meant to be. Anyways, keep watching, subscribing, uh, and uh, hope you like uh, my new content coming soon.